Below is John's multiplication of 548 by 35. Is he correct? To figure out if he's correct, we are going to multiply um, 8 times 5, which is 40. So we're going to carry the 4 and then put the 0 down in the 1's place. Then next, we are going to multiply the 10's. 4 times 5 is 20 plus the 4 carryover. So that is 24. <laughs> then we're going to multiply 5 times 5. 5 times 5 is 25 plus the 4 carryover makes it, the 2 carryover makes it 27. Where's the magic zero? Oh no, we don't have one. Okay. Now there's now we do 8 times 3 which is all right, 8 times 3 equals 24. You put down the 4 and carry the 2. Next is 4 times 3, which is 12, but 2, which is 14. You would put down the 4 and carry the 1. Now it's 5 times 3, which is 15, plus the 1, which equals 16. Now you would put 16, and now the answer is 1,644. But wait, he forgot the zero. Um, Aubrey? Well, we're we supposed to just figure out what Okay, but the problem is there is no magic zero. So we're going to have to make it. Now, the real answer would be... Okay, this is not hard to answer. We've got um, 3 times 8, which would be 24. So we put the 4 right here, and then we put the 2 right here. And then 3 times 4 will be 12, plus the 2 will be 16. Now it's time to add 0 plus 4 equals 4. 4 plus 4 equals 8. Oh my gosh. That's the wrong answer. We have to do the correct answer because they didn't put down 0. So we are going to do the rest of the problem later, but the correct answer for the full number is 19,180.